שלום לכל צופי יורומיקס, אני שחר אסידו. אני טל דהן. ואנחנו נמצאות במופע של הזמרת היווניה המצליחה אנה ויסי, שהצטפה באירוויזיון שלוש פעמים והגיעה למופע חד פעמי בישראל. זה מה שהיא אמרה לנו בריאיון הקצר שערכנו איתה מאחורי הקלעים. Uh, we are so honored to have an interview with one of the most successful Greek artists, Anna Vissi, who performed in Israel. How are you, Anna? <laughs> Now I'm like uh, flying in the air, in the skies. How is the Israeli audience? I had uh, one of the most uh, amazing uh, concerts ever because I was uh, singing in front of people that I, I didn't really know what they were expecting. Mm -hmm. uh, but then... They don't know the language, you know, I heard they love uh, Greek music, but uh, while uh, the concert was going on and going on and going on, I felt the love, I felt the love and the uh, embrace. You have a huge career, over 50 years of career uh, in Greece and Cyprus and all over the world, basically. And you started uh, your musical career at the age of 12. What attracted you to, uh, to uh, music at such a young age? I don't know, I guess uh, the nature. I was born to be a singer. I knew it when I was five years old. I was singing in everywhere I was, I was singing. In the car, in the bathroom, in the, at the school, uh, in my house. My mom, was, my mom knew and uh, my sister was playing the piano and we were playing, she was playing the piano and I was singing and she was, uh, my mom was, uh, you know, uh, Uh, helping us, advising us. So uh, I think all my life I was a singer. Uh, we're creating a Eurovision uh, content and you took part in Eurovision three times. The first one uh, was in uh, 19... Auto stop. Auto stop. Auto stop. Auto stop. In 1980. Uh, how was it su suggested to you? The first time? Yeah. I don't even remember. It was so long ago. <laughs> Uh, I guess, I think, you know, I, I remember, it was from the national TV. Mm -hmm. They called me, I think they called a few people, and I presented this song, and they chose this song. So it was kind of a competition. <laughs> Second time, uh, I went with Cyprus. Yeah. Um, and uh, I think that was uh, like they, they called me on purpose and they said, you know, do you want to go to the Eurovision? Of course, <laughs> who doesn't want to go to the Eurovision? And today I sang it uh, in uh, Hebrew. Lama tzuvli, lama tzuvli, davka shetovli. Kolka. Kolka. Amazing pronunciation, by the way. Really? Yeah. I think it's because I'm Cypriot. We have the sh, the ch, mm -hmm. we have this. Uh, yeah, and as you dialect. mentioned, <laughs> sorry. As you mentioned, you took part in the contest again in 1982 with the song Mono Yagafi, and you gave Cyprus one of the best results ever, the fifth place. Uh, could you sing for us a bit of Mono Yagafi? I just did. Lama <laughs> Tuvali. למה עצוב לי, דווקא שטוב לי כל כך? למה עצוב לי, למה עצוב לי, שכל היופי נשאר? אמייזינג. ואת הראשון הייתה עם... למה עצוב לי, למה עצוב לי? אני כל כך טובה סינגר, אני כל כך טובה. לא, אתה טוב. Thank you. You, you, you. To be a singer, I mean, you have a nice voice, you hit the notes, right? But you have to sing from your heart. Give some heart, you know, when you're singing. Anyway, what's the next question? <laughs> uh, so you took part in Eurovision also in 2006 with the song Everything, which is one of my favorite Eurovision songs ever, of I have course. to say. It was an amazing song. But you see, not always the amazing songs uh, win. It's uh, every time it's a different, uh, I don't know, something in the air. Though I have to admit that when they asked me mm -hmm. who
who do you think is going to win? I said, uh, Finland, the monsters. I don't know. I felt uh, I had an intuition. Yeah. Um, so you both uh, experienced a modern and uh, old uh, Eurovision contest. Uh, what is the main difference between uh, your participation in uh, the 80s and 2006? Uh, I guess the, the presentation, it's always it's the evolution of the show. You know, the production is now massive, you know, everything is yeah. uh, so amazing. But I, I don't want to say, because it was then, it was amazing too. Even in a small theaters, I remember when I sang Auto Stock, it was just a theater, you know, with poor lights. So everybody was focusing more on the song, let's say, than on the show. So now it's more because we live the, the years of the, the, the image, you know, it's everything about the show. So uh, then maybe was more the essence of the song. Now it's the presentation of the song. What do you think about the Greek and Cypriot entries for the, the last years in the competition? They are doing quite well. Well, uh, unfortunately, this year I didn't follow because I was on tour. And I was very sorry to hear that Cyprus uh, didn't participate. Uh, the yes. Lately, though, lately we had good songs. Both countries, they presented good songs. Yeah. They, at Agree. least they try, you know. For the best. I agree. Um, you have a rich career uh, of dozens of albums and hundreds of songs and even a number of international hits. <laughs> What's the secret? I can't tell you, it's a secret. <laughs> Great answer. Uh, what message do you wish con to convey to your Israeli fans? Last question. What, 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 sorry, what? What message do you wish to convey to your Israeli fans? I love Israel now. I'm, I fell in love with Israel, with Israeli, of course, with people. Uh, a country is the people. And uh, you have a great country, you have great people, and um, with uh, passion. And I, I can only judge uh, from the way they embraced my music, of course, from the history that I know. And I have a big connection with... Uh, with Israel and uh, with the Jews, uh, especially, because I, I participated in a great project, in a great musical, and I performed as a Jewish woman in Auschwitz. Uh, so my connection is huge. Mm -hmm. I, I felt uh, um, uh, this, I felt so moved when I, when I performed this heroine, Mala, uh, and it's one of the things that I will never forget in my life. And maybe, maybe, I want to say the best, best thing that I've done in my career. That uh, musical. Thank you so much, Anna, and enjoy. Thank you. And the message is peace. רוצים להישאר מעודכנים בכל החדשות שקשורות לאירוויזיון? רוצים לעזור לנו להמשיך לספק כתבות מעניינות לתחרות? יירשמו כמנויים לערוץ היוטיוב שלנו.